Chipotle next, uh, another stock that actually did really well uh, throughout the entirety of 2020 from a business perspective. They found ways to deliver their product, do online uh, delivery. Uh, people would do, you know, come and pick it up on takeout, all that kind of stuff. And they did keep sales pretty, pretty strong. Uh, Chipotle actually caught an upgrade to a buy rating uh, from Stifle, I believe. And basically the analysts saying they've demonstrated impressive resilience during the pandemic. And we believe the brand is going to benefit in 2021 from increased consumption consumer mobility, and several sales building initiative. A nice little breakout here on the chart as well. Mark, uh, do you love the, do you like this yeah, company? We go to a weekly chart. This has, this is one of my favorite position trading uh, breakouts where you have a big run, right? Which we did. Chipotle was one of the fastest moving companies off the March lows. Um, you know, when, when you, when, when, when things were recovering in March, April, May, June, Chipotle was one of the fastest moving companies. And then you have the, expected because things can't go up a billion percent forever every week cooling off periods and what i love about this pattern is you have a multi-month consolidation pattern following a nice up short-term uptrend and then you got the most underrated indicator in technical analysis the 20 weekly and what happens as it, chipotle goes Bounce, 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 consolidation. Now you have a breakout. And so from a position trading standpoint, this is one of my favorite patterns in position trading. Big run up, multi-month consolidation, 20 weekly holds, which to me signifies resilience. And then you break out of that. It's a beautiful pattern from a position trading standpoint. Um whatever the reason, whether it was an upgrade, this or that or not. So mm. Tyler, what are you seeing in the chart? Well, the thing is, is that's what you've been waiting for this entire time as well, because, you know, ever since it got it, it had that deeper retracement in September, really, there haven't been that many clean technical setups. It's just been chopping for four months. Um, the, the, the technical analysis phrase I like is, is the longer the base, the higher in space. I mean, when you when you base sideways, the the base that. Yeah, when you base sideways, like Mark mentioned, that that many t that many months, and then you finally break above it, it it's it's just a clear signal that um, you know consider this a, a tug of war, a stalemate. Bulls won; they won as you would expect because it's in a longer term uptrend, and um, it's gorgeous volumes volumes swelling to uh, to confirm it. It doesn't mean it's going to go straight up, but uh, it's great, man. This is about as good as it gets when it comes to breakouts.